Hola. Hola. Uh, Lightspeed Spanish, this is podcast number 33 for Early Intermediate. And today we're talking about something really interesting. In my opinion, <laughs> it's really interesting. It's interesting to me. And that is the difference between the verb llevar eh, with reference to taking time and tardar about taking time as well. Okay, so that's what we're going to do today. Pero primero. India? Sigo muy bien. Desde cuándo? Desde hace cinco minutos, diez minutos. <laughs> desde el podcast anterior. Yeah, sí. <laughs> ¿Cómo estás? Muy bien, muy bien, sí. Sí, sí, sí. Um, a ver. Mmm, ¿Con ganas? Con de ganas. Hacer este podcast? Sí, con muchas ganas me interesa mucho. Pero, Cintia, si hemos pasado mucho tiempo riéndonos. Sí. Eh, al principio no, no de, suficiente. No, no al principio de, de los vídeos, bueno, lo sentimos, ¿no? ¿Por qué? Yo no. ¿No? <risa> sí, Yo vamos no a intentar eh, como mantener la, la risa de, de un, un minuto, un minuto y medio, ¿no? Y luego cortar la risa, sí. ¿no? <risa> <risa> ¡Ya, tiempo! Ya. No te rías más. Sí. Vale. Sí. Es que lo que pasa no. es que... Lo, lo estamos pasando bien, ¿no? Aquí. Claro. Gramática, güey. Sí, sí, sí. Vale. Chistes y cosas. Mm. <risa> es típico. Las clases no sé, de gramática. ¿Tú sabes un chiste sobre la gramática? Sí, pero ahora mismo no puedo no, pensar. No, es que estaba pensando en a man walked into it. Ah, pero no. Two peanuts. Ah, um, walks into a bar. And one was assaulted. <laughs> sí. Pero eso no es gramática, bro. No, no, no. <laughs> Está sacando lo que sea, India. Lo que sea. Vale. Ok. India, ya. Yeah. Now sí. it's your turn to help us with this and your turn to help me with this. Ok. I love the verb llevar. I have to say. Oh. Because it's so much quicker than our version that we have to learn in English. I have been here for 15 minutes. Um, and in Spanish, three words. Llevo 15 minutos. That's, that's it. Yeah. That's all you have to say. Okay, and that's, let's start there then as a point. Yes. Right. So when, when you want to say, I have been here for, I have worked here for, I have been married for, all of this, yes. I'm, what the Spanish do is to say, I'm carrying, X amount of time, years, months, it's weeks. It's heavy on me. Yeah. And so you just say, <laughs> llevo 30 años casado. No, no es cierto, no? Or, so sometimes you'll use it with um, uh, an adjective, yeah? Yes. 30 or, años casado. Yes, or with a gerund. Or with a gerund, yeah? Llevo, llevo preparando la comida una hora. Mm -hmm. I've been preparing the food for an hour. Mm -hmm. O llevo una hora preparando la comida. O llevo so una hora preparando la comida. Mm -hmm. Sí, pero the I have been is the llevar. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's talking about I have been, yeah? Yes. But then there's another use of llevar, which is to say, like, how, how much time, time it's taking you. Yeah, yeah, to take time. To take time that's, to do something. That's llevarse. Okay. No, llevarte. It's not, it's not reflexive, sorry. Mm -hmm. it's llevarte. Llevarte tiempo. Mm -hmm. Something takes your time. Okay. Um, so, for example... Construir este castillo de Lego me llevó media hora. Okay. So, what we've got there is we've got the indirect pronoun, the... Um, Furniture removers pronoun to me, and then this it has carried. It's, it's just like in English. Took me, me took llevo. Me. Ah, yeah, took me. Because the verb to take also so llevar. Correct. I never realized that. You see, doesn't matter how long you learn Spanish, it's, it's, <laughs> it's good. It's there. <laughs> I'm liking it. Okay, so it took me, it took me, it me llevó. Uh -huh. Me llevó. Oh, yeah. Cynthia. Keeping. Un momento. Bonvilla. <laughs> Wow. Yes. Okay. Sí. Me llevó. All right. So that it took me. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, and, that's it. But then, it took me. But then we've got um, tardar. Okay. Tardar. So I took. And then that is it's a different way of making the sentence. Mm -hmm. Tardé 30 minutos en construir este castillo de Lego. Okay, so that verb is, there's no tardar. pronoun, just... But there's a word like tardar, tarde or something. Yeah, like, if you, if you, can, be, you can be tardy, you can arrive tardy. And, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm running a bit, um, a bit tardy. It just means I'm late. Yes. So it's about time. It's, so, it's about time. And yeah. for example, I would say le, la tarde. If you arrived in la tarde, you would be tardy. Yeah. So you can make that into a verb. Yeah. So you can either say tarde or tardo. If you want to say it, it takes me. Yeah. Yeah. Um, tarde. So that's you. You conjugate the verb. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you said tarde. I took this time to do this, or something took me this amount of time. So tarde or me llevo. Me llevo. It took me. This thing took me. 30 minutes. Esto me llevó uh, 30 minutos. Mm -hmm. Yo tardé. I took. Can you say I took? I took, yeah. I took 30 minutes building this. Yo okay. tardé 30 minutos mm -hmm. construyendo esto. Okay. So you can choose. And we're putting that in Same the past thing. tense, but also it can be oh, in the present. The, sí. You can say tardo. Normalmente tardo eh, mm, 40 minutos en preparar una tortilla. Mm -hmm. La tortilla, preparar una tortilla me lleva 30 minutos, 40 minutos. Me lleva. O he tardado. He tardado. I have taken. But me ha you, llevado. Me ha llevado, ¿sí? Me ha llevado. Mm -hmm. ¿Sí? So that's two options. And really, the, it's your choice of whichever one it's, you want to use. Yeah. What do you tend to use in English? Mm -hmm. It took me. I took this amount of time doing this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's... The same, <laughs> same structure. Okay, okay. So let me test you out then. You are testing me out <laughs> in English or in Spanish? No, I'm just to see how long it takes you to <laughs> do things. Testing me, I love it. <laughs> ¿Cuánto tiempo tardas en vestirte, típicamente? Do I respond or do I have to translate? No, you have to respond. Ah, I just they, they know what I'm asking. Yeah? Ah, okay. ¿Cuánto tiempo tardo en vestirme? Mm -hmm. Tardo en vestirme en vestirme solo ponerme la ropa sí cinco minutos cinco minutos sí, sí. Uh -huh. Gordon cuánto tiempo tardas tú en el cuarto de baño por las mañanas cuando hay personas esperando típicamente típicamente eh, tardo <risa> Digamos, 10 minutos. 10 oh, minutos. 10 minutillos. Vale, vale, 10 minutos. Sí, ok. Can sí. we just talk about the, the, the prepositions that go with that? And so we've got tardar and we use en. ¿Ya? Yeah? ¿Cuánto tiempo tardas en? En. Doing sí. something. Sí, yes? tardar. En mm -hmm. hacer. Mm -hmm. sí. And then with llevarte. No. No, no preposition. So, ¿cuánto tiempo te lleva vestirte? ¿Así? ¿No? ¿Cuánto mm. tiempo te lleva vestirte? Vestirme me lleva... En el, mm -hmm. una hora. ¿Y cuánto tiempo tardas en vestirte? ¿Cuánto mm. tiempo tardas en vestirte? ¿Sí? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, with llevarte, no preposition, with tardar, en, typically. ¿Any other preposition that goes with tardar? No, 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 Ok, muchísimas gracias. Gracias por ese momento. <risa> <De> nada, <risa>
It takes me, it takes me. Qué sencillo, joder. 15 años después. 15 años de... Tarde, <risa> sí. Me... Tardí. Me ha llevado... 15 años. <risa> Aprenderlo. Muy bien, muy bien. Vale. Perdón, buen trabajo. Entonces, eh, hasta la próxima. Nos vemos. Y nos vamos. Hasta luego. Adiós.